All right, so how do you feel the dating scene has changed? Well, how do you feel the so social media? How do you feel that social media has changed the dating scene in the United States versus Dominican, Repo Dominican Republic? Even the women, like the women, how do you think they taking it with social media? How do you think the American black women taking it with social, or just women in general in the United States. Like, how you I mean, feel this change really? How dating really going? I mean, it's really the same in both. You know what I'm saying? United okay. States and Dominican, but you know what I'm saying. It got it's always gonna have a slight twist to it here to me. You know what I'm saying? Because you know the females, of course, they using the social media to make their money. But the female in the states, they using it to make their money too. But yeah. you know what I'm saying? I feel like in the states, you got a lot more closet freaks than you do out here. These ain't no closet freaks out here. They straight up with it. You know what I'm saying? They don't care. You know what I'm saying? So you got a female that's gonna be outside on Pedro, and you got a female that's gonna be online. Yeah. You got a female that's on both. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, yeah. you know what I mean? But uh, as yeah. far as the dating scene. On social media, period, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? People look at the internet like it's like it's God. So, you know what I'm saying? You go yeah. on, they go on there and become whatever they want to be yeah. on the internet. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, they, you know, photo, Photoshop it. So do you think it's better you think it's better for the women nowadays? Like, so you think social media made it better for the women to make more money? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. They got a further reach. They can do more from they from right. they from their couch than they could. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you can do more from your couch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yes. I mean, I don't know if that's a good answer or not. But no, nah, but that is that is like they. That's what I'm saying. It, they smart enough. I think social media just kind of smarten them up. Really, like they they getting put on to more shit now. I mean, I don't feel like you talking about the, the DR one. Even the D, both. No. They making more money now. You don't think social media giving them more chance to make more money to get over on, on on more men now? Cause they got a broader sense of they got a broader reach to men now. I mean, I got a totally different men. Type. Men sending them money, just sending them money. Yeah, you get what I'm saying? Like versus just getting what you get from 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 just without social media. I feel like women can they got options now. They feel like it's an illusion of options now. Yeah. But see, I like a few. That's why, that's, why, that's why I feel like it messed up the dating scene, really. Because now they feel like they got more options versus dealing with they do that home or do that work. They imaginary options, though. They but Because you really don't got what you think you got. You got a lot of people. Well, relationship-wise, but money-wise, them, boy, them boys sending cheese. Them boys sending bread online. Until, until they see what you look like for real, for real person. You understand me? Until they see that. So you better just stay behind that screen. You know what I'm saying? Until they see what you look like in person. Take that goddamn mask <laughs> off, boy. You know, <laughs> ain't nothing <laughs> personality. That personality going to have to shine. Hey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> For real. Yeah. And hey. then they, they then they they asked that like excuse my lady but they just asked after that but you yeah, know yeah 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 but you know what I'm saying yeah, I'm into some cool chicks bro like I will say this honestly being out here in the dr like I'm attracted to a totally different type of female than I am in the states you feel me because mm -hmm. in the states you know what I'm saying I, I'm I like a woman that be on her stuff because I be on mine yeah. so. You know, like that's real. That's the real. Last girl I dated, that's real. Like, she was on hers. That's you know real. Yeah. You know her priorities was a little out of whack. She, you know, what I'm saying for the most part, she had her mind right, but it was just, you know, what I'm saying that's so real. Like, that's real. I don't want a female that's so consumed with the internet that that's all she do. I that's mean, all she do. That, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, you right. You gotta bro. do something else besides the internet. Besides you know the saying? internet, you gotta do something else. So you I gotta mean, do something. So else. I would say that the internet has taken a negative impact. On relationships. On relationship, it has made right. it hard yeah. to date than before the end of it. Yeah. I, that's, that's, that's my answer. Yeah. I feel like it's such a negative toll because, you know what I'm saying, some people just live for social media. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? That's a terrible thing. You yeah, know? like I say, especially here in DR now, I feel like, you know, they they kind of know they kind of know what's going on, like I say, because the information now, even from the States, it's coming to, it's coming to DR now. So it's like, they really expect, now they expect more from the from from the dude, you know what I'm saying? They look at you like they they got the American mindset now, yep. and that's what we really trying to get away from. Yep. Because 
No, go ahead. Go ahead. If you ain't making no money on the internet, what is you doing? If you ain't making no money on it, then why is you on it? Why is you on it? That's how I feel. That's bro. that's pretty much how. Yeah, you wasting your time, really. <laughs> you just wasting your time, bro. Scrolling and you know you get it. You get you. If you ain't on that, like I say, but is the consumer and is the producer. You know what I'm saying? Like which one you gonna be? What they say you got the buyer and the seller. Yeah. Yeah. Which one you gonna be? And that's what I feel like the world going into. That's a whole nother segue. We ain't gonna segue into that right now. Yeah, you sure. That's a whole nother topic. That's a whole nother topic, bro. But like I said, it just they it's like, you know, the women get on here, they using what they got now to get what they want. What they say in players club, use what you got to get what you that's pretty much what they doing right now. And like I said, they getting the American mindset right now. But see, that's the thing though. A lot of these females too, they they using what they want to get they use what they got to get, to get what, what they, they want. want. Yeah. And then they get used up and then they wanna you know what I'm saying? Then they want to settle down by that time. You already it's ran through. Nobody want it no more. And that's what's going on, bro. That's what's going on. It's just like, bro. You know, they get it. it, it like I said, it's it's a, it's a, it's like the era of just consumerism. Yeah. Like it just do do so much. It's like everybody because everybody's chasing that dream. Everybody's chasing that, trying to get that bag. Everybody trying to do whatever they can do to get that 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 money. You know what I'm saying? Because they feel like it's, it's the way out. Yeah. And that's what we're going with it too. It's like that's what it's pretty much where everything going right now with the internet age, bro. It's like everybody getting desensitized, you know what I'm saying, to a lot of things right now. You know what I'm saying? It's 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 shock, it's all about shock value. Not for real. Shock value, you know what I'm saying? Everybody trying to recreate something, do something new. Everybody trying to find new ways to do something and no. get to that paper. That's really what it's about. That money at the end of the day, because it feel like the more and more we get on online. You just see the most craziest shit now. No cap, bro. I remember back in the day, bro, we used to go, <laughs> used to go on YouTube, bro, and watch twerk videos. You know what I'm saying? That's, <laughs> they only move over shaking their booty with shorts. You know what I'm saying? They got they up. Now you can go on there and you can get some <laughs> soft porn. Oh, you, it's crazy. Booty up, boy. Say. I remember back in the day, boy. You get a booty picture. Say. Yeah. You a player? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you got to do a go on Instagram. Boy, you see all that? Yeah. Shit? I'm talking about, you know what I'm saying? When like, you say desensitized, bro, I bro, definitely feel you over there, bro. It's too much now. The, the essence of a woman has lost. It's lost. It's lost, bro. Like, just that, just that, like, just that little bit of, like, uh, tease. The tease is gone. It's gone, bro. It's no more tease. It's like, you can, <laughs> you can just see it all out. Right? You know what you're getting before you get it. Before you, you get gotta it. You got to try you know what I'm saying, <laughs> like, it, it, bro. Really? It's just, it's just going somewhere else right now. It, 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 that's, it, that's what I'm saying. I don't know where none of this is going, bro. Yeah, but that's yeah. why, but that's why, we, <laughs> look, that's why we, that's why a lot of, I feel like that's why a lot of men leaving the states. Yeah, because like we getting the bang for our buck now. Not for real. You know what I'm saying, like it's, it's a lot of stuff in this world that you know what I'm saying. Like I said, we trying to figure out and we trying to see. And it's different cultures. They do things just a little bit different. But everything is so sexualized, though, bro. Everything is so sexualized. Everything but, you, so but, sexualized. But, but you got females in the states. You sexual. You so sexual, but you withholding the sex. You make the nigga work so hard. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But the nigga didn't seen everything. You seen everything. But you ain't hand it over. He yeah. work versus her. Yeah. But that's what I said. It goes back to now. It's just. Everything over sexualized is just now. Nah, it's just it's just about the money. Yeah, it's just about the money. No, it's no more feelings. It go back to our answer the question I asked you, like just relationship wise, like it's no more feelings. There's no more like lovey dovey relationship. It's just uh, it's about the money. Maybe can you take care of me, or you can't on my hand in the streets. And that's crazy, bro. Because money, no feelings. Yeah, you ain't lying, bro. No feelings out here, bro. It's no feelings. That's the same. No feelings, no ceilings. No feelings, no ceilings. It's just, you know, the ceiling has broke. You know what I'm saying? We in a whole other world, bro. It's no feelings, no ceilings. It's all about that bread. You know what I'm saying? Nah, for real. That's it. That's That's it. That's all it's about. That's all about that bread now. But that's why I said we leaving. Us, us, us men, we leaving now. We leaving the states, bro. We trying because guess what? It's gonna be women out there that ain't never experienced me. I'm, I'm from a different culture, different, and that's what I'm on. I'm on different cultures. I'm learning different languages. 
You know what I'm saying? Ni hao wo jiao, Chris. You know what I'm saying? Ni jiao shama ming zu, hang gao shi nur shi ni. That's Chinese. You know what I'm saying? I don't... <laughs> I don't treat me. I said, this nigga, yo, this nigga. Damn. You fucked me up right now, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. You fucked me up. What? What the fuck? Bro, I thought I was tripping, bro. <laughs> Must not be heard, bitch. Must not be heard, nigga. Bro, what the you, fuck? <laughs> oh. Then look at this nigga's face, you everyone, this motherfucker. Hey, yeah, bro, ain't nothing wrong. Well, with you ain't never know what you get on the podcast like this, boy. Hey, <laughs> nothing wrong with excelling, man, and learning new things. Listen, bro, that's what it's about, man. Different cultures, different people. You know what I'm saying? We're Dominican, Dominican Republic, man. <laughs> At Bunny 727, man. Capital Trade, man. Listen, man. You never know what you get on the podcast. Y'all got to stay tuned. We got more shit on the way, man, but we ain't done yet. Oh, so, so, damn, what are we talking about? I'm going to cut that. Man. I got a question, man. So when you, when you, when you, when it comes to visiting VR, man, you know what I'm saying? I know it's always good to, you know what I'm saying, take pride in your appearance, but how much do you think a guy has to put into his prison the presentation of himself out here to have the 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 you know what I'm saying yeah you know to get, get to get what they want you feel me do you do or do looks really matter out here that's a good question do looks really matter out here in Dominicana you know what I'm saying for 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 in Dominicana any or any in any um. Or any country? No, nah, in Dominican. In Domin- Dominican, Dominicana. Coming here for the chica. When it comes to dude coming here for the chica, do you really think? The okay, I'm gonna get my. Um, well, really, it do, but it don't. It do, but it don't. Because once again, like I say, this this ain't American culture. American culture, we kind of glamorize um, fa- fascism. You know what I'm saying? Fashion. Um, the way we dress, the way we look, you know what I'm saying? Like we glamorize, we glamorize that high price tags on clothes and shoes and stuff like that, jewelry and stuff like that. Out here, they they know about it. But like I said, we we pretty much the black culture. We like they glamorize Jordan. They glam, they wear Jordans. They wear. I don't be walking around in Jays. In Jays. They be Wookies, but they listen, they they listen to they listen to Tupac. A lot of them listen to Tupac. A lot of them, bro. They they love Tupac, bro. A lot of them listen to Tupac, like black culture. So it's like they know about the black culture, like no, because they black too. You know what I'm saying? They black, but they know that you know they be like you know me Dominicana. You know how they be. Yeah. Me no black. Me Dominicana. They love their culture. That's good. They know their culture. You know what I'm saying? But all in all, it's like they know they know the they know they know the clothes. They know the shoes. They know what's in. They know the fashion. They know fashion. They be out here dressed up. Don't get me wrong. They ain't the richest. They ain't like they ain't got the richest like America. But they be out here. They know how to put that shit on. They put that shit on. Sometimes they they dressing better than me. Nah, for real. I ain't out here dressing like nothing. Then go back to your question. I don't want to be out here dressing like that, bro. I got a couple of fits, whatever I wear. I don't really buy clothes like that. That's my money elsewhere. Well. Investments. I mean, the, the, your, your, your style, you got, a, you got a unique kind of style, though, to where it's like you ain't got to do all that, really. You know yeah, you ain't like, got to do all that. What, what is it like? You got kind of like a minimalist Type of yeah. sway, you feel me? Yeah, like, you know yeah, yeah. You ain't coming out too flashy. Yeah, you ain't you know, coming like out too. Yeah, like 
if nigga come down Pedro and you stand on the block, they gotta know you to notice you talking. Right. You be standing in the cut. Yeah. They might not even see you. you Money, I'm saying? like a fly on the wall. Me personally, I'm like a fly on the goddamn wall. I don't even want to be noticed. Nah, for real. That's I don't right. even want to be noticed. I don't want. I, I don't be wearing. A, I, don't, I don't put that shit on like that. I feel like that's a smart thing to do. Though. I don't want to be. No, I don't want to put this shit on like that because, bro, I don't want to look like a tourist. You don't. You don't want to look. I like, don't want to look like no tourist. I want to fit right in. Nah, for real. You know what I'm saying? Because you look like a tourist, they gonna treat like a tourist. Nah, for real. They gonna think you got the cheese. They, they gonna think you got the bread. They gonna treat you like a tourist. They gonna ask you all type of questions all the time. You know, because I say it's a hustle culture. So they gon' they gon' ask you if you look like a tourist, like you got money, you from you got the country, you got the state, whatever. They gon' ask you. They gon' treat you like a tourist. So, but like I said, they know they know when you got them J's on, you got that shit on, when you got that jewelry on. They gon' treat you like okay, this nigga. They gon' dig. He deeper. here for a weekend, so we gon' try to we gonna try to get, get him, him for the weekend. We gon' try to expunge. His Ex- expunge your goddamn pocket. You can wear that shit up out here now if you want to. Yeah. You're going to get charged, she gonna, too. <laughs> you going to have that goddamn gringo price we talking about earlier. You definitely going to have that gringo price. You're going to get the gringo charge regardless, but you know, you yeah. got to find they're trying to... Because they can smell it. They can smell it on you. They try to hit you with that end. They, they can something. smell it on you, boy. They can smell that real. gringo on you, boy. I'm going to tell you right now. They know when you, when you brand spanking new on this motherfucker. Yeah, they do. They do. They do. I I'm definitely agree with you on that. They bro. know when you brand spanking new, boy. They know when you when you here, and they know when you gone. We some familiar faces out here. Like, yeah, we some familiar faces. They now. see us. They don't see us every day. Yeah. When you see me. Yeah. You see me. Remember. You gonna remember. <laughs> and that's another thing too. They got some good memory. Yeah. Don't think they ain't gonna remember you. Yeah. Especially the women too. The women gonna remember you. They know who. They know. They remember who they been with. You know what I'm saying? The women gonna. They gonna remember your ass now. They don't forget now. They got good spanking memory. Yeah, they do. They do. They do. They do. They do. Some they of them try some... to hit you with their game like you done been with them before. Really, ain't oh, yeah. You, you ain't yeah. hit you with their game before? Like, yeah. Right, you trying to play with yeah. me. Right, yeah. Yeah, I don't have that too, yeah. I know yeah. your type. Yeah. yeah. I know yeah. your yeah. type. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, man. What you think about the food out here, man? Oh, that was the next thing. We had the next thing about the food. So, 